Thanks for tuning in to another Coach's Corner. We'll get right after it here. First off, just wanted to say thank you to all the fans that made it out to watch us uh, at our home duel on Friday. Unfortunately, it wasn't a great match for us. We were disappointed in some ways. Uh, I thought we wrestled a little bit flat. I thought a couple guys didn't do a great job of managing their weight. All these things are obviously very, very important if you want to be successful. Um, it is early. Our ultimate goal is always to be ready in March, so we don't spend too much time dwelling on it but uh, we need to learn from it and continue to grow. Uh, the nice thing this weekend is we had a chance to rebound very quickly on Sunday. We head down to Brookings, South Dakota and we wrestled the Dactronics Open. Um, overall, I thought our guys wrestled great on Sunday. We won seven of the 10 weight classes. Um, we had the McKee brothers both had, picking up championships. Patrick's match was extremely exciting. Um, he came back and scored a takedown late in the third period and then picked up some near, near fall to seal it. But it was a, a good weekend for Pat. Uh, Mitchell McKee continues to uh, really wrestle well as he picked up another championship. At 157 pounds, we had a true freshman, Baylor Fernandez, who's done some great things, is looking really sharp early in the, the season here with us as a, as a gopher now. And he picked up a really nice uh, win there, won a championship, revenged a loss from uh, a week before, but it was a good weekend for him. Um, 165, Bailey O'Reilly had a great weekend. He won on Friday. He also won. Uh, the championship there down at the Dactronics on uh, Sunday. So he's doing a good job. He's, he takes a lot of shots. He's very high energy. We love seeing the growth that he's um, putting out there right now for this Gopher program. 174, uh, Devin Skatska looked great on Sunday as he picked up the championship. Uh, really dominated his weight down there. 184 pounds, Owen Webster continues to wrestle very well. He picked up a nice win. Had a big win on Friday night as well. So uh, he's doing a really nice job. 97, uh, Dylan Anderson lost in the finals. And um, at heavyweight, we had Bobby Steveson who come out and got a, a championship for us. So Bobby's done a great job. Really nice having him. He came in on short notice. Uh, we needed him, he stepped up and uh, he wrestled for us on Friday and also filled in and, and did a great job down there on Sunday. So we're excited about that. Also going on this weekend, we had a lot of our senior level guys that were competing at the Bill Farrell out in New York City. Um, they had a great weekend overall and wrestled really well. Um, we had Gable win the championship at heavyweight there, it looked great. We had two other guys take third, Nazar and Hayden. Um, both had great weekends. And on top of that, we had Brett Farr who took fourth place. Um, earlier in the tournament, Brett beat a world silver medalist at his weight as well. So it was just overall a great weekend for our guys. Those guys were out there getting some competition. If they were the highest place in America, American at their weight, then they qualified for the Olympic trials coming up. And so that was kind of nice for, for the guys that were able to do that. So that was the, the weekend there. Uh, looking forward, this weekend we have another big duel. We go down to Oklahoma State. Um, that'll be on Sunday at 2 p.m. If you can't get down there, I know it's far for some of you guys to drive, you can catch us on ESPN Plus. So um, that's kind of what's coming up and what's going on here in our program. So look forward to talking to you guys after the duel. Go Gophers and we'll see you soon.